Alan Joseph Bard born December 18, 1933, is an American chemist. He is the Hackerman Welch Regents Chair Professor and Director of the Center for Electrochemistry at the University of Texas at Austin. Bard is considered a father of modern electrochemistry for his innovative work developing the scanning electrochemical microscope, his co-discovery of electrochemiluminescence, his key contributions to photoelectrochemistry of semiconductor electrodes, and co-authoring a seminal textbook. <laughs> Early life and education Alan J. Bard was born in New York City on December 18, 1933. He attended the Bronx High School of Science and graduated from the City College of New York in 1955. He then attended Harvard University, where he earned a master's 1956 and a Ph.D. 1958. Research In 1958 Bard began working at the University of Texas at Austin and has continued there for his entire career. However, he took a sabbatical in 1973 and worked in the lab of Jean-Michel Savayant. He also spent a semester at the California Institute of Technology as a Sherman Mills Fairchild Scholar. He lectured at Cornell University for the spring term in 1987 as a Baker lecturer. In 1988 he served as the Robert Burns Woodward Visiting Professor at Harvard University. Bard has published more than 900 peer-reviewed research papers, 75 publications, and has more than 23 patents. He has written three books, Chemical Equilibrium, Electrochemical Methods, Fundamentals and Applications, and Integrated Chemical Systems, A Chemical Approach to Nanotechnology. The title, Electrochemical Methods, Fundamentals and Applications, is the defining text on electrochemistry in English, and generally referred to as just Bard. The Center for Electrochemistry was founded in 2006 in order to create a cooperative and collaborative group between the different types of concentrations in electrochemistry. Bard and his group were one of the original researchers to take advantage of electrochemistry to create light. The creation of light produced a sensitive method of analysis that can now be applied to a wide variety of biological and medical uses, including determining if an individual has an HIV and analyzing DNA. The Bard Group also applies electrochemical methods to the study of chemical problems, conducting investigations in electro-organic chemistry, photoelectrochemistry, electrogenerated chemiluminescence, and electroanalytical chemistry. Topic: <laughs> Personal life. Bard was married to Fran Bard until her death in August 2016. They have two children, Ed and Sarah, and four grandchildren, Alex, Marley, Rachel, and Dylan. Topic. Awards Among Bard's awards are the Priestley Medal in 2002 and the 2008 Wolf Prize in Chemistry. He was elected a Fellow of the American Academy of Arts and Sciences in 1990. Bard was elected to National Academy of Sciences in 1982. On February 1, 2013, President Barack Obama presented Alan Bard and John Goodenough with National Medals of Science, one of the highest honors a scientist can hope to receive from the United States government. The medal honors people who have made incredible contributions to either science or engineering. I am proud to honor these inspiring American innovators, Obama said. They represent the ingenuity and imagination that has long made this nation great, and they remind us of the enormous impact a few good ideas can have when these creative qualities are unleashed in an entrepreneurial environment the University of Texas at Austin No. On January 13, 2014, Dr. Alan Bard was awarded the Enrico Fermi Award along with Dr. Andrew Sessler. The Electrochemical Society established the Alan J. Bard Award in 2013 to recognize distinguished contributions to electrochemical science. Topic References. Topic External Links. Center for Electrochemistry at UT. The Bard Group at UT. Good enough. Bard win National Medals of Science.